Gospel star Dumin Kokstad dumped. Shama Records boss and top gospel artist, Dumizni Dumin Kokstad and Zamanda has lost his first artist, Nathan Sithol. Dumi owns Shama Records and Nathan was his first artist. Dumi introduced Nathan to the gospel industry and he helped him record two albums, Wamaul Yezu in 2018 and Ungakum Buell in 2020. But on Friday, February 3rd they parted ways. It is said that Nathan felt neglected and decided to dump Dumi's record label. In his public statement, Nathan wrote, this dispatch serves as an official statement to all relevant stakeholders, event organizers, and fans, that Nathan Sithol is no longer under Shama Records after an amicable decision in the best interests of both parties. He will pursue his music career as an individual artist. I appreciate the platforms and doors that Shama Records opened for me and the guidance, coaching, and mentorship by Dumin Kokstad. Nathan told the publication that he wanted to grow and explore the gospel industry on his own. I am not a talkative person, I'd rather keep quiet and act instead of making noise. Dumi has done his part, he gave me enough exposure and I've grown, now it's time to go, he said. He said they had a verbal contract, we intentionally did not write it down because we didn't want to be bound by it. The only condition was that I'd do two albums with Shama Records then I'll be free to do my own thing. This is exactly what I'm doing, I have given him two albums and both of them did very well. We shared the profits in half and we were all happy. But now I need to be on my own, it's about time I collect all the profits of my music. Dumi told the publication that Nathan felt neglected. He approached me and I just started my recording label. I took him under my wing and gave him all the support which includes sharing my platforms with him. The two albums did not do well, for the first he was still new in the industry. The second album which was released in 2020 failed because of the lockdown. In addition to this, I have other artists who need my attention. These challenges were too much for him and he felt neglected in the process, said Dumi.